gallery back here at barbecue and yeah that's how this cook started my uh, canon 80 d going down but listen we will power through and hit that subscribe button ring that bell so you get all my uh, future uploads notifications of course and look this is a good one this is a must make if you've never had a Jersey style Italian hot dog, you are in for a treat. And look, the ingredient list is quite as simple. Onion, potatoes, and peppers, right? Preferably green peppers, along with a hollowed out Italian round bread if you can find it. If not, you could use a, use a hoagie roll or use your bread of choice. basically what I do we don't need all that bread in the middle so I'm gonna hollow it out like I said and uh, you'll see why as we uh, roll along towards the end also I have my uh, master built screaming at 700 degrees of Fahrenheit also to this we have uh, two boiled potatoes Okay, now look, these are about 80% done, so more to the al dente. And what you want to do is basically just a slice them up. About quarter inch slices will do. And from there, what we're going to do is a salt and pepper them up. So look, that's a few onions, a few peppers, some hollowed out round Italian bread, and also some uh, boiled potatoes, about 80% cooked. And now you can see my uh, flat tray in and also I have a, a cast iron skillet filled with about a little less than a quarter inch of oil and all that is going to be uh, smoking hot. You basically what you want to do is get those uh, peppers and onions on, right? You're working this as a, a flat top. So you want to uh, saute everything up. And uh, meanwhile, that cast iron skillet is uh, screaming hot. The oil is approximately 500 degrees Fahrenheit. And basically from there, what you want to do is stop, start uh, dropping your potatoes in to uh, kind of crisp them up. Be careful because that oil, like I said, is hot. times on this really doesn't matter because you're gonna just crisp everything up you're never too burnt on an Italian hot dog We roll along, I'd say probably after five minutes or so, we're gonna just start getting those potatoes out and getting them on the grill. And in goes our uh, Sabret hot dogs, of course. As the uh, potatoes cook, we'll uh, put some on the grill and we'll put some on that tray. And basically what we're doing here is we're making uh, room for our hot dogs, of course. You can see those hot dogs have a nice brown going already. And again, you can uh, not overcook anything on this dish. A uh, Jersey style hot dog is supposed to be uh, crispy and uh, nicely cooked. And 
again, cooking times really don't matter because uh, you just want everything uh, nice and crisped up. That's a crisp up. So basically what we want to do here is we want to get that uh, hot skillet off because we kind of need the room, but uh, be very, very careful because that sucker is piping hot. As are those uh, hot dogs, of course. made uh, two quick ones up for the uh, for the wife's uh, mom-in-law right she uh, delivered them uh, very uh, safely right we have that uh, social uh, distancing still happening but look this is what you do you get yourself some yellow mustard you uh, put some in on the uh, bottom there Basically, you want to uh, just kind of stuff it, right? We got a, a dog in. We'll get another half a dog in and then just kind of smash some of those crispy, salty, peppery potatoes down and in. And of course, you'll get some uh, onions and peppers in. Oh, man. And look, just uh, that's why we hollow out this Italian round. Just kind of just stuff it in, just stuff it in. That is a packed with flavor right there. So we got that yellow a mustard work in the bottom and then all that goodness stuffed on top. Oh, man. <laughs> now you know this one's mine. And of course we'll uh, top it all off with some uh, ketchup, right? And that, my friends, right there is a Jersey-style Italian hot dog. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. And look, as I, uh, as I make up this uh, last one for my uh, wife, let me just mention a couple things. Number one is I do have a Master Built Gravity Facebook group. I'll leave all these uh, links in the uh, description, right? So, uh, look, if you're interested, it's free to join and check it out. We cover everything a master built gravity. And also, that 25 off crowd. Now, look, also, that uh, $25 off first time purchase to uh, crowdcow.com is also happening. You can get, uh, look, you can get six tails, lobster tails from Maine delivered for approximately $50. You can't beat that deal, so check that out. And also, that 15% off haleyhome.com for a custom cutting board like I use on the show. Look, all those offers help the show out, so uh, definitely check those out. And uh, whoever just sat through that, the first three people, that hashtag comment, Uncle Steve Shake, down in the comments, will get a, a free rub sent to them. And look, that is USA only. Apologies for that, but uh, shipping would be uh, too much. And look, that's it. Hit that subscribe button, ring that bell, and go make yourself an Italian a Jersey style oh, hot dog because oh, they are definitely worth it. And if you like this master built video, I'm going to drop a couple links here. You go check those out, and we will see you there. <laughs>